Welcome to SAP Taxes. Today we would like to discuss about SAP integration component for Vertex. The SAP application area and Vertex application area are integrated back and forth, meaning the data from SAP application area will flow to Vertex application area and it gets back uh, the tax related decisions into SAP application area. So we will see the end to end um, how this uh, SIC which is SAP integration component is linked with uh, Vertex application area. So there is a gateway and there is a Vertex integration area. So these are the two uh, distinct components uh, within which the integration happens. So let us look at what are the application areas which are primarily integrated with the Vertex CRM and SD modules I mean sales and distribution module and uh, materials management module then all your supplier relations management SRM module then there is a finance okay so basically these are the five application area components which are having hooks to call vertex and then get back the results within fi you can think of other sub modules like gl ap ar so these are the sub modules you can consider as the entire thing as a finance right fi modules so there is a tax link area within the sap application area which means all the calls which go to vertex are routed to the tax link area and then uh, Vertex also developed a bolt-on that is called SAP Vertex bolt-on uh, which is native to SAP application area and written in ABAP code which means the moment that you have Vertex bolt-on uh, it looks like a similar SAP code with SAP transaction codes which are exclusively developed by Vertex for the SAP uh, uh, linking of the tax area okay so all these application components like modules are linked to your tax link area obviously anything that you are trying to call to the vertex will go through this, uh, through this standard rfc kind of mechanism uh, from the tax link area okay so you have a rfc which is like basically a gateway uh, which is a technical code to call remote function call right basically you are going to call other systems in this case vertex so the rfc resides in sap and part of the sap gateway uh, which collects the information from the tax area and then makes the call to vertex so how does vertex receives the information so there is a java component sap java component which re, which is receiving calls from a remote function call module which is rfc okay and then that sap java component is passing the information to the sap integration component developed okay so basically this integration component is a critical piece of product which makes the seamless integration with the tax area so again SAP Java component is linked to SAP integration component SIC and from there the tax engine is called so the tax engine contains rates tax loss information and it it is linked with all the web services right and sometimes you can use vertex as SaaS based solution or on-premise so if you are using either way right so end of the day the application from SAP is calling to the tax engine to determine the taxes and then get back the information from tax engine again back to the SAP integration component and then you know all the way back to Java component and back to RFC okay so so this is the end-to-end -end description of how the data flows from SAP application area to vertex application area okay so all the tax decisions which are made needs some information from uh, from application modules such as you know vendor address vendor details right and the moment the vendor details are going into 
or vertex application area so then it gets back the information such as jurisdiction code in the case of us and canada and other details in the case of other countries so for example other details meaning like you know whether when there is exempt or non-exempt kind of information okay and then it is integrated all along with the different components within the sap application area it may be input taxes output taxes or you know any other kind of tax determination is happening from the application area all the way to uh, vertex and then the information is passed back so from the configuration point of view so this entire sap integration component is kind of a technical integration it's a technical you know people basis people uh, will install this uh, there is an installation guide for sap ic and sap java component and then now uh, within sap uh, in the ABAP developers the development team will configure all the rfc calls um, and the logical destination for rfc call to the tax engine and then uh, based on the vertex bolt on based on the sap configuration this predetermined the tax link area right so the tax link area is the one which like determines like what from where this particular call is coming back to vertex so the tax link area is you know piece of code which collects all information and presents back to uh, vertex and get back the information uh, from the tax engine and uh, you know all the calculations do happen in the sap application area so in in future uh, discussions we will go into more details of how exactly different components work and also how the com configuration is triggered and we'll try to show you how vertex is configured vertex components and uh, you know vertex uh, different levels of information which is present in the vertex engine and it's you know mostly on the vertex side and it's again it, it needs a special skill set there uh, obviously you need the tax knowledge and also the technical knowledge to configure the tax engine and back into sap area again if you have worked in the sap any any kind of taxes the same kind of taxes are available for the vertex also and uh, you know whether it's the international tax or us tax uh, canada us canada international europe and uh, you know pretty much all all countries are you know covered for the vertex so vertex you now international version is there vertex us and canada version also is there so you know please uh, visit simplefinancesupport.com for more tax related information the knowledge and also the explanation about the component how they are integrated how entire the linkage or the integration works and also the nice videos will explain you the more nitty-gritties of the configuration and also the concepts behind uh, tax calculations okay so all this will be explained very clearly at the simplefinancesupport.com please do visit here and if you require any tax consulting uh, please do contact us thanks for uh, thanks for visiting uh, and again you know we are um, bringing a lot of uh, sap s4 hana uh, simplification series as well and uh, you know please do stop by at uh, simplefinance.com for uh, these videos thank you